to hear. I'll tell her what she wants to hear. See if the Queen Regent is ready to receive us. Nah, she's never gonna be ready. She's dead. <laughs> Hello. Looking You'll for his little mask. I know you will. You may feel one thing, but you must say another. I won't say anything. I'm not saying anything to you. Good luck. Shut up. I don't answer to you. You sleut. Oh. Alright, more cogs. Cogs are saving, I think, so I can stop at any point. But I won't, because I'm looking forward to playing this game. Well, I am playing it. Oh, there's the. Oh my God, it's the game. It's the throne. It's a little. It's a little guy. I've seen that little guy. Oh, it's the little guy. Quick, we need to go and look at the little guy. Go, 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 run. I'm pressing all the buttons. I'm pressing all the buttons. I can't. I can't run to the little guy. There he is. No. Who's this guy? Oh, it's a little guy! Yay! Ah, Lady Marjorie, aren't you looking lovely this evening? I am. Lord oh, no. Tyrion, Your Grace. Oh, Lord Tyrion. With yeah. Your permission, allow me to introduce Lady Mira of House Forrester. Hello. Um. Uh, kneel before her. I'm gonna be a suck up because that's what she asked me your to do, isn't it? Oh, she's Eclipses. pleased. Impressive. You may rise. House Forrester is a northern house loyal to the king. Are they? I beg your pardon, your grace. I wasn't talking to you. I want to hear from the girl. I want to hear from the girl. Is your family loyal to the king? Yeah, they were dead loyal to her. The new Lord Forrester. Um, he's not here, is he? I loyalty never wavers. If you look at the girl, the queen. Her necklace looks like it's painted to her chest. Indeed. Look at that. For centuries, it's the definitely. Have been loyal I think she's got a tattoo house. of a necklace. A house of traitors. Um, they're not traitors. Not traitors. Your Why would you say I agree to no, your family are traitors? Perhaps once, for a northern house. Shut up, now, you. Now then, your hair colour doesn't even match your eyebrows. How did yes, that happen? Because you didn't have dye in them days. To your new liege lord. Roose Bolton. Um, I don't know. What, I don't. I wasn't listening, so I'll just have to say absolutely. Absolutely. I wasn't listening. I was too busy talking about our eyebrows. In fact, Roose Bolton allied with Walder Frey. If it was me, I'd find it difficult to so quickly forgive the men who killed my father. Oh crap! It's because I wasn't listening. Old allegiances are not easily abandoned, but now that the war is over, we must look to rebuild and forge new alliances. There are ships and shields to be built, and Joffrey will need a Joffrey. Ironwood for his armies. Ironwood. I'm oh yeah. There are others who would happily serve that purpose, but I trust we can rely on House Forrester. You can rely on us. Ironwood does seem rather unique. Um, yes, yes, Your Grace. I was going to say many um desire our Ironwood, but I imagine you'd do almost anything to prevent that from happening, wouldn't you? Almost House anything. Forrester. And they do whatever was necessary to save Casterly Rock. It would be unfortunate to see another house lay claim to Rock's Falls. Um, I, I want to dishonor myself. myself. Your Grace. Yeah, I'm not doing whatever you want, I see. but I'll do some things. Well, I'll clean shoes, Why but I won't have, have sexual person. intercourse with the little man. She fought beside the staff, wielding a battle axe for the Northern Army. Um, there's certain things I'm able to do. Sir Sai, or whatever your name is. Can we truly blame those who end up on the oh, jeez, did you see that? Her name. Whatever. To the Baratheon on the false assumption that he would one day rule the Seven Kingdoms. Fifty-six Kingdoms. Can we fault her for her mistake? Should she be held accountable? Yeah. Um. She only followed her heart. She was just following her heart, Your Grace. And the very same heart. So quickly led her to my son. If oh no! To this, I hope you find it quick. She's displeased with my answer. I, I've, I've not well, been listening. I need to listen. Hard thing to define. No, it's not. The alone is filled with all sorts of ambitious opportunists looking to reinvent themselves, pretending to be something they're not. Who knows? Your eyebrows are pretending to be something they're not, Your Majesty. 
You are a girl from the north here in service to Lady Marjorie. One can only assume her interests are yours. Yet loyalty to a king, that must be absolute, beyond question. And if no, it is in question. If you become conflicted between your king and the very person whom you serve, what would you do then? Cut the lives off. I'm sure she Let the would girl answer the question. Um go on. I am loyal to Marjorie. I serve at her pleasure. Clearly your handmaiden does not have her priorities straight. Shut up, Hugh. Your eyebrows don't have their priorities straight. The crown, isn't she? Straight. The most dangerous handmaiden in all of King's Landing. I'm not quite sure what to make of her. Not surprising, I suppose, for a northern girl. Stop calling me a northern girl. I'll start calling you eyebrows. I'd like a word with you, if I may. Yeah, of go course, on, Ginger. Grace. Don't look at me like that. Eyebrows and Ginger heading into the back room. Wonder what they're doing there. And you, Tiny. Go away. I'll walk you out. Okay, Tiny, come back then. This I thought I thought you were. But I met your father once at the tourney at Lannisport. I thought you were um going to be good, Mike. <coughs> Let me talk. Quickly, but your father struck me as an honourable man. You have my condolences for his loss. Um. These would be trying times for your family. Thank you, Lord Tyrion. Whatever you want, Merty. That's very kind of you to say. It is pretty kind for you him to say. To declare your loyalty to Lady Marjorie. Yeah, I was pretty brave when no I. Was I'm still not having sexual intercourse with you, though, mate. She will not soon forget what you said. It was quite the first impression. Um, I of course found it all highly entertaining. I wasn't trying to please her. I think that was clear to everyone. My sister and I have our differences. Oh, she takes sisters and brothers. In okay. Charades. I take mine in thwarting them. We must find our amusements where we can. She you don't have to. to give your ironwood to another house. It is the master of coin who decides such matters. Master of coin, Bitcoin. Crown needs boats. Oh yeah. Boats need wood, and I speak for the crown in this regard. Um. Not her. What, what are you suggesting? suggesting? What are you suggesting? Why can't suggesting? I, I can't talk today. Persuaded to secure ironwood from House Forester. Yeah, you could easily they persuade us. We're pretty easily persuadable people. Lines. And it would infuriate Cersei. Although what would be amusing for me might prove rather dangerous for you and your house. Don't do it then. Are you willing Obviously. To risk that? No, of course not. Where's the no answer? I'm, I'm afraid sorry, I can't. Lord Tyrion, but it's a risk I cannot afford. I admire your discretion. Do you? You better do. Now, if Tiny, you smash your head right into that into them into that wall there, into Three them into that wall. Um I'm gonna say good night because Callboy said it. Just be careful. And this, this is, is not the and it's the middle of the day. Can be a nest of vipers to the uninitiated. No, it can't. Shut up. Leave. Go on. Go on, Tiny. Walk me to the door, then walk back to your chair and drink more alcohol. You pissed. Okay, let's leave. What? Oh, cogs. Yay! Ooh, she's hidden it. Dun dun dun. Mira. Oh, it's her. She's not evil then. Well, she still might be, but um, not so great. Cut her head off then. Nah, it's not over. She threatened to cut my head off, so I cut her head off. That's why I didn't go. That's why I didn't go well. Of course, you and I are seated way at the back here with the fourth cousins and the ninth-born sons. Nice bomb sons. Sir Jamie, I wouldn't mind tarnishing that light cloak of his. Ho -ho. <laughs> what? It's true. Ho -ho. And over in Martell, the red viper. Uh, what, what are you on about? I'm told he has a paramour. Put it back. Put it back. We're just having a bit of fun. He'll probably progress. I've heard he's a bit perverse. Yeah, he probably is a bit perverse. Perhaps Lady Marjorie can make the right introductions. Who knows? We might meet our future husbands. Ho oh, ho, we might do, so but we won't. King, I can only imagine what that would be like. Pretty terrible, because they normally always get killed. Joffrey, if it meant you'd become queen. 
I don't know who Joffrey is. Have a certain look about him. Um, and he's always treated Lady Marjorie well. Uh, which is more than you can say for uh, uh, my family. Anyone, if it helps my family. Oh no, it's probably going to say she would remember that. Well, I would marry him. Imagine the power. Oh no, I didn't say it. Never mind. Queen of the Seven Kingdoms. Fifty-six kingdoms. I might even fifty-six. Be my handmaiden. Oh, and then I'd Let cut your head off. See. Brian of Tarth and Tyrion Lannister. Oh, not Tyrion. What a perfect match. Sir Bronn and... What are you doing? Jesus, she teleported into the room, didn't she? Well... Um... Sir, I'm sorry, my lady. I'm sorry, my lady. As am I. We shouldn't have been messing about. What will she remember? This is not a game. She will so remember that she's, um... She'll remember that she's forgotten the back of her dress. Men who are powerful. The queen you're was pretty powerful. I said you're pretty forgetful. By your display, mirror. Well, no. I'm just glad it's over. What did you and eyebrows do in that room, eh? Ginger and eyebrows. Sometimes. What did you do? There's always someone to please or some perceived slight to smooth over. No, there's not. Don't lie to me. I fear it will only get worse when I am queen. You're never going to be queen. Heart, the lords and ladies will have no choice but to love you. Except when they cut your head off. Do you agree? Um. Uh. 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 Yeah. Once yeah. I agree. Queen, the lords and ladies will do their best to please you. You learn very quickly. I do learn pretty quick. I mean. You were brave, agreeing to obey the Boltons. That cannot have been easy. I know you must fear what Lord Bolton might do to your family. He I won't do anything to my family. Your willingness to appease her, as difficult as it may have been. Thank you, my lady. There's been something on my mind. Something important. What is it? Oh, it's, uh, I don't know what it is. Uh, ask her for help. I'm gonna ask her. I, I did have a favour to ask of you in return. Whatever you wish to say, you can say it in front of Sarah. There are no secrets between us. There is a secret. Me and Sarah are planning to it's cut your head off. about my family. I trust her. Uh, Sarah missed her. Um. On. Ask. Uh, my mother needs our help. Forgive me, my lady. I wouldn't otherwise ask this of you, but my mother insisted. It's about my family. But as Mrs. you've Snow. forgotten the back of your dress, then what would you have me do? Cut his my head off. Crossbow bolt in between his eyes. Ramsay is left to do as he likes. She thought if a raven could be sent to the Boltons to let them know House Forrester has the protection of the crown. I know it's a lot to ask of you, and I wouldn't otherwise, but she insisted. Did she though? Oh, I asked on request. behalf of your mother. Especially now. I know, my lady, and I wouldn't ask this of you otherwise. You've already said my that. My mother has left me no choice. She insisted. Joffrey knows only too well your family fought for the Starks, and now you would have me ask him to intervene. That's exactly what I just asked you. Yeah. Is the situation that dire? You can't, my lady. Yeah. King Joffrey won't like it. Just think how um, tender Lady Sansa. Uh. I'm not gonna beg. I'll be in your debt. I Ooh. will forever be in your debt. My family will forever be in your debt. Debt. All right. Okay. She's gonna do it. Unless Sarah is gonna be a I right twat. Know, oh no. Find out. Cut Cersei's head off. It's fine. You're adored by the king. Don't there you go. You. Go on. Bring you her over. over bring her over to our side. No one else does. Not even his mother. Oh, the white smirk. I would never ask this of you if it weren't so urgent. Not that urgent, though, is it really? Very well. I'll make your request, but I cannot promise anything. Good. Thank you, my lady. I will send a raven to my family at once. Will you? You better do. Send that raven, quick. Send it. Oh, she's not sent the raven in time. 